Hello guys, today in this video I am going to show you Filmora's new reference line feature. Reference lines are one of the most important tools for video editing, creating text animation or adding elements to video. Let's see where you will find it in Filmora and how to use it. On the interface, click on Preview Screen Settings and you will see an option of Ruler. Click on it to activate the ruler on the preview screen. Or you can right click on the preview screen and select Ruler. Now to add reference line, go to the ruler's edge and left click, hold and drag the reference line out. You can drag the reference line from the horizontal and vertical ruler. You can add as many lines as you want to. If you want to change the line color to create a reference line for a different element, right click on the ruler and select add guide option. And then you can change the line color, select the reference line direction and then enter the value to place the reference line. When you press OK, you will see that the particular color reference line on the preview screen. You can even adjust the reference line position on the preview screen by dragging them with the mouse. Now to lock the reference line, right click on the preview screen and from guides, select the lock guides option. Now all the reference lines are locked and you can't move them. To unlock the guides, right click on the preview screen and from guides, select unlock guides option. Now if you want to hide the reference lines, click on the preview screen settings and select the hide guides option. And to bring them back, click on the setting and select show guides option. To delete the guide, right click on the particular guide and select the delete option. Now let me show you how to use reference lines to align the text. First drop the default title and create text. Create multiple text. Now to align the text to a particular position, add reference lines on the preview screen and place them in the place of text alignment. And align the text to that position. Then align the second text using vertical reference lines. This is just for an example, you can place text to any position which is suitable for your video. Once done, hide the reference lines and you will get a perfectly aligned text on a preview screen. You can create a whole grid with the reference lines to place the text and other elements on the video. That's it for the day. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel for more awesome tutorials. See you in the next video.